We're at the Ark Encounter in Kentucky, USA. Now, here is a letter from Brother Joseph Branham at the Branham Tabernacle. Dear lovers of the Word of God, how wonderful it is to be able to address each of you as lovers of the Word of God. There is nothing that can take its place. To have the opportunity to listen every day of our lives to our Lord speaking to us through human lips and telling us who he is and who we are. There is no place, no voice, no church, and no man that can tell you these things like the voice of God. He told us of the inspiration of the word was on the tapes. All we have to do is press play and the Holy Spirit fills the room. Our messenger was drawing life and light from the resources of that main bowl. He had his wick dipped therein. His life is on fire with the Holy Ghost. His wick life had been immersed in Christ. Through that wick, he is drawing the very life of Christ and by it gives us light to us, the bride. Then he tells us, not only is his mighty messenger's wick there, but we are all drawing from the same source. We have all been dipped into the same bowl. We are dead to ourselves and our lives are hid with Christ in God, sealed in by the Holy Ghost. No man can pluck us out of his hand. Our lives cannot be tampered with. The visible life is burning and shining in us, giving light and manifestations of the Holy Ghost. Our inner invisible life is hidden in God and fed by the Lord's word. We have the revelation of Jesus Christ in our day. How the word feeds our soul. There is nothing like it. How he has provided a way that the bride from around the world can gather together to hear the voice of God at the same time. No matter what the critics or the skeptics say, God has made a way and it is a sweet smelling savor to him. He just told us that he'll get us all together at the end of the third day. Glory. Let us all come together this Sunday at 12 p.m. Jeffersonville time to hear the voice of God bring us the revelation of the word as we hear the Patmos vision. 60-1204E. First, we must get into the spirit as we are going to hear the voice that sounded forth his word in the Garden of Eden and upon Mount Sinai, which voice was also heard in the excellent glory of the Mount of Transfiguration, was once again sounding forth, and this time to the seven churches with a complete and final revelation of Jesus Christ. Brother Joseph Branham, scriptures to read in preparation for hearing the message. Remember to read and hear the seven church age book. Isaiah chapter 28 verses 8 through 12. Daniel chapter 7 verses 8 through 14. Zechariah chapter 4 verses 1 through 6. Malachi chapter 4 verses 1 through 2 and Malachi chapter 4 verse 5, St. Matthew chapter 11 verses 28 through 29, and St. Matthew chapter 17 verses 1 through 2, St. John chapter 5 verse 22, Hebrews chapter 4 verse 3 and 4, 
Hebrews chapter 4 verses 7 through 10. Hebrews chapter 4 verse 12. Revelations chapter 1 through 9. Uh, Revelations chapter 1 verses 9 through 20. And Revelations chapter 19 verses 11 through 15. The storm clouds of judgment are coming. Get into the word and be safe. This is a very serious time. And until next time, if there is a next time, God bless you and shalom.